y'all welcome to my youtube channel today is thursday may 2nd and today i am going to be filming a keto full day of eating vlog so this week has been a bit of a crazy week so on monday we officially bought our new boat it is all done we got all the papers however we still have to wait a few more days to pick it up on Tuesday, my dad flew into town. He had to come to Mobile for the first time ever for work. So big coincidence that I'm here. So I've gotten to see my dad. He got to see my new apartment since he hasn't seen it yet. So it's just been a great week. This morning, I got a call from my dad that he had lost his wallet and that's a big panic because he'd have no way to get home this afternoon on the airplane but we just got a call from the hotel they found his wallet and i'm about to head to go pick it up so crisis is averted and so so thankful he found his wallet but anyways i am about to make myself some iced coffee and then head out the door to go pick up his stuff Okay, so I just finished filming, and I look over here, and this is what's going on. Look at Bo sitting there sucking on his stuffed cat. Oh my god, is that not the cutest thing ever? Look at this sweet little baby with his baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's such a sweetheart. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is too much. My heart cannot handle it. is well in the world I have secured the goods but on my way out as y'all saw I made myself some iced coffee so what's in it is coffee heavy whipping cream and a little bit of some sweet leaf stevia drops in the vanilla cream flavor so I am working on that and now Mr. Bo and I who I have with me we are going into PetSmart to get him some dog food because I have been trialing out some new foods for him lately because there's been that big study coming out about the association between grain-free diets and dogs and the dilated cardiomyopathy. And Bo is a breed that's at risk for that. So I'm taking zero chances and I've switched his food up. We're gonna go in and get him a bag of his expensive food. He eats better than I do, I swear. Do you wanna go to PetSmart? You wanna go to PetSmart, where the pets go? Or is that Petco where the pets go? I think it's PetSmart. Let's go! <laughs> what you doing? What you doing? This is the food we switched to, this Purina Pro Plan Saver. This has little bits and pieces of like beef in it and Bo loves it, don't you buddy? Let's buy some dog food. Ow, did that hurt? You little psychopath. Bless you. You ready to go inside? You ready? Let's go. And I met my dad at Hurricane's Grill, had some lunch, said goodbye. It was great having him in town for a couple of days, but now he's got to go back home. For lunch, I had a grilled chicken salad, and it had chicken, cheese, blue cheese, and lettuce. 
it wasn't that good at all. I had ranch on the side so I can like control the amount of dressing that I'm eating. I just like dip the corner of my lettuce in there. But still, that salad was gross. I ate the chicken and a little bit of lettuce, but it just wasn't that good. Anyways, while we were at lunch, we got an unexpected phone call that our boat is ready for pickup. Ah, we didn't think it was gonna be ready until next week because we had to wait until the check cleared, but everything's gone through and it is ready for us to go get it. So currently, we are on our way to Biloxi, Mississippi for the final time to go pick up our boat. I am so excited right now, it is unreal. But what I'm not excited about is this weekend, I am headed out of town. Early Saturday, we're driving to Jackson, Mississippi, and then on Sunday, we're driving to Baton Rouge, Louisiana, and then on Monday, we will come back to Mobile. So, of course, first weekend we have our boat, we don't get to take it out because I'm gonna be gone. But yeah, that's what we're doing right now, is we are headed to go get our boat. All right, guys, we are picking her up. And she looks beautiful. I can't believe she is ours. Oh my golly. Just look at her. I cannot wait to get out on the water in this. She is a beauty, oh my golly. Look at that, that is ours. Holy moly, I cannot believe it. Up here, we've got us a fish finder and a GPS, and we've got a stereo system so we can rock out on the water. What is it? Stereo. Stereo, that's what I said. Stereo. Stereo. Not stereo. Stereo. Radio in case of emergency. We officially have the boat. It's being pulled behind us. Oh, she's beautiful. I can't believe she is ours. But we just had a couple very tense moments because there was nowhere to get gas and I was on below E. And with this big old boat behind us, it is sucking down gas like nobody's business. So it was very, very tense. We thought we were gonna run out of gas, but we made it to a gas station. All is well in the world. We're not tense anymore. I'm still a little tense. <laughs> Help me guys, he's crazy. <laughs> it was very scary to be, you know, on a highway and the thought of running out of gas, not good. Anyways, we are about to stop by his parents' house, show him the new ride, but we just stopped at the gas station and we were both so thirsty because while we were at the boat place, the trailer lights weren't working, so we had to stand out in the sun for like an hour trying to get those to work, which I'm thankful that, you know, that he had no problem with fixing it all before we drove off the lot, so very happy about it, but it just took forever to fix, but I'm glad it is fixed. So yeah, we were so thirsty. So I got Milo's famous sweet tea, but it's no calorie. I think it's sweetened with Splenda, which is not the best sweetener by any means, but your girl just wanted some sweet tea. Just sounded so good. So that is the update for now. And I'm glad we got gas. Bo is not a fan of Cody's brother on the riding lawnmower. It's not a fan. Bobo, are you making friends? Hi, Brooklyn. We just finished up getting the boat all squared away for the night. Cody and I left at like three o'clock today and it is now 8.30. So we've been gone for like five and a half hours, but your girl is starving now. The only thing I've had today is that iced coffee this morning and then I had that chicken salad for lunch, which was pretty mediocre. There's Cody. So I really have not had much to eat at all today. So, for dinner, I decided I am going to make a low-carb fettuccine alfredo because we went to a steakhouse last night, so I have a little bit of leftover steak. I have some low-carb noodles and some alfredo sauce because that's about the only things we have in our fridge. So, 
we're gonna hope that it works out. Let's give it a try. This is my leftover steak from last night that I cut up. Over here, I have some of this new pasta in the fettuccine style. And then the Alfredo that I'm going to use is this Bertoli Mushroom Alfredo. For these low carb noodles, all you do is drain the liquid that they come in and then rinse them really well. Basically, all I'm going to do is I have some Alfredo sauce heating up over here and Cody choking in the background. Sorry. And then I'll throw in my steak, let that warm up. And then throw in the noodles, let it all heat together for a minute or two, and that is going to be my meal. Here is my completed fettuccine alfredo with some steak in it. Quick update, my pasta sucked. I threw it all in the trash, except I ate the steak out of it. So now it's back to the drawing board of what I'm going to do for dinner. Just to show y'all that I'm not lying, this is what our fridge looks like right now. We've got an assortment of cheese, some wine and some eggs which i don't feel like eating so we just have like nothing in our fridge right now since my fettuccine was an epic failure i had one of these flex pro meals in my freezer it's about the only thing i had so this is going to be my dinner by default i guess so this is a broccoli and cheddar bake and this is what it looks like there's some broccoli over here, and then on this side, it is ground beef with this little broccoli cheddar sauce that just kind of melted into the beef. So, yeah, that is going to be dinner. Not the most appealing thing, but it is what it is. It's going to have to do the job for tonight because um, I failed at going to the grocery store. So, here she is, dinner. Hey guys, it is now the next morning. Last night after I ate my dinner, which was that Flex Pro meal, which was so-so, um, I came into my computer to like clear out my memory card and I didn't realize it, but I deleted some footage I didn't want to delete and it's like permanently deleted. And it just put me into like a really crappy mood. I was so mad at myself for doing it. So, I didn't pick up my camera to film last night and close this out because I was just angry at myself. But, you know, it is what it is. I made a mistake. Can't do anything about it. So, yeah. I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't done so. And I will see y'all again real soon with another video. Bye, guys. Mm-hmm.